which is I need your help with um, Sunday Swap. And Sunday Swap, if you don't know, it's being built on Cardano. It is a it is the uh, decentralized exchange that uh, everybody's really rooting for because now we can actually have real world utility instead of just staking Cardano. And for that to happen, when Sunday Swap goes live. They're going to do an ISO, which is an initial initial stake offering, or an ISPO, initial stake pool offering. And when you stake your Cardano uh, with the uh, recommended stake pool operators, instead of getting uh, paid or get uh, rewards in Cardano, you're going to get rewards into the Sunday Swap token. Which, if you were around when uh, Uniswap came about and they gave all those tokens away, same type of thing. So I think this is a pretty massive play, and I'm excited because we can finally get some real world utility using a DEX. Well, the thing is though, is they're going to look for trusted operators. And this is where I ask for your help. And just like I made that free website, Dan Teaches Crypto, so I can call on the markers when I need them, this is the time that I actually need them. And all I need you to do is to vote. And how do you vote? Well, you can go to the website, ISO, ISO.SundaySwap, but all I really want you to do is just to uh, put a specific amount and send it to yourself in your Cardano uh, wallet. That's how they uh, how are you going to vote because they're going to look on the blockchain. So real quick, uh, I'm just going to do this for you. You don't even have to go to the website. I'll show you exactly how this is done in uh, Daedalus, in Yoroi, and Ada Light. So first of all, uh, vote number one. Let's go for D News. I'm a little biased. That's just how it is. And when you click on D News, it's going to say this is how much uh, to send to yourself. We can look for this in the blockchain, 2.365. And you can only do two votes. And also, if you vote for like a third time or a fourth time or whatever else, um, only the last vote will count. So when you vote uh, for your stake pool operator, that's it. If you keep voting and voting and voting, only the last one counts. So for the vote two, you can add whoever you want to. You can do uh, Cardano Paul. You can do uh, CCV, Crypto Capture Bridge. You can do Ape. A to ape or whoever you want to do and uh, just put them in there so i'm not uh, biased towards anyone that you want to do i'm just gonna be biased towards myself today and all they want to do is well, actually no let's just put in let's just put an ape okay so ape we'll put in there and see the number here 2.365254 right all we want to do is take that number and put it into our wallet so i'm going to start with daedalus wallet let me jump over there Okay, so first thing first, I'm gonna go into my Daedalus wallet and I'm gonna bring up uh, the receive part. I'm going to receive, so I'm gonna actually uh, click on share, which is gonna copy, uh, copy the address. This is where I want to receive my own tokens. I know it sounds weird, but hold on. So you're gonna send it right here. You're gonna paste an address, which is your own address. Again, you're going to send the exact amount. And it's gonna say here, the receive your address belongs to the same wallet. If you proceed with this transaction, the transfer funds will remain in this wallet, yes, and you will incur transaction fees as outlined in estimated fees. Exactly right. And what we're looking for, of course, here is we're looking for that number 2.365254. 2.365254. Uh, so what I'm going to do then is I'm going to bring it up again and put in 2.365254. And I'm going to send that. Actually, I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to send that. I'm going to put in my password, pop, 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 and that's it. And then it's going to send it, and that is going to uh, actually register my vote. And the same type of thing can be done if we're talking about uh, going into, like, the Yoroi wallet. So here's my Yoroi wallet. I'm going to, again, I'm going to click on receive because I need my own address. So I'm going to copy this right here. I'm going to send it. Who's the receiver? Bah. And the amount, two point, what was it again? Great. Custom amount. 2.365254. We're going to click next. I'm going to put in my password and I'm going to click on send. And the fee is, of course, minimal 0.16, no big deal. Send it. Great. And the same thing can be done. I hit a light again. Receive. I want to get my address. We're going to ba -ba -ba, copy the address and uh, just click on that. Copy to clipboard. Fantastic. And I'm going to send, let me click down this transaction, receive data, send data. I'm going to click on send data. The receiving address is my own. Ada, the amount, 2.365254. And that's it. Calculating the fees. And not much, 0 0.17. I'm going to send that. And voila, it goes through. So if you could do that, that would be great. Also, if you're looking to figure out like, well, how do I stake things? And as far as like Cardano or even uh, Avalanche, 
Dan teaches crypto.com, 100% free. If you look on the mobile, uh, click on the menu, go to staking, and there's two sections, A to stake and A back staking, and that'll take it. So uh, that will take care of the first part. So thanks so much uh, for helping me out. Let's get to the good stuff. Let's talk about a little evolution of Bitcoin. 